The 2018 NASCAR Cup se Series season is finally underway, and we have a new season of Running Flat Out. Hello everybody, my name is Dylan Heidorf, and welcome back to a new episode and a new season of Running Flat Out. Today's episode, I'm going to be talking about the upcoming weekend at Daytona. It's the Daytona 500, you guys, I'm so excited. But before we get to the big news of the Daytona 500, and I might even make a prediction on who's going to make or win the race, I'm going to get to a few more subtle things in the NASCAR season. After the advanced auto parts clash at Daytona, NASCAR released the power rankings. So without further ado, I'm just going to go through the top 16. So 16th, they have Jamie McMurray. Below him is Ricky Stenhouse in 15th. Daniel Suarez, which I think is a little bit interesting. Uh, they actually had him higher before the advanced auto parts clash. He's at 14 and they originally had him at 12. William Byron, He's at 13. Alex Bowman is actually 12th, probably because he won the pole and he had so much speed during qualifying and practice. Eric Jones in the 20. He is ranked 11th. Next, we have Joey Logano in 10th. He's up one, which I think that's a little surprising. I mean, he's he's a good plate racer. I mean, he's won a Daytona 500. He's got a few Talladega wins. I don't think he's ever won the summer Daytona race, but he's amazing at plate races and I think he he probably should be a little bit higher. Next in ninth, they have Jimmy Johnson. I mean, he's never been the best plate racer, but I mean, he does have a few wins at, at Daytona. Next, we have Ryan Blaney. Kevin Harvick, he's ranked seventh. Chase Elliott is up in sixth. Uh, in fifth, we have Denny Hamlin, who is going to be starting on the front row in the Daytona 500, which I guess is kind of cool. Brad Kozlowski is ranked fourth after winning the Advanced Auto Parts Clash. Third is Kyle Busch, the 2015 champion. Second, I mean, I guess this is kind of obvious it's Kyle Larson he was kind of quiet during the clash anyways we'll move on to the first rank Martin Truex Jr the reigning champion I mean I guess this ma this makes perfect sense for him he had what eight wins last year and I think he's he's probably gonna make the final four again this year if nothing happens to him but yeah that's the NASCAR power rankings as of today so just scrolling through the NASCAR app and, and the headlines that they have Peyton Manning is going to be the honorary honorary pace car driver for the Daytona 500 this year which is pretty cool so now I'm gonna move on to the little bit more exciting parts of this video I'm going to talk about the Daytona 500 as you know Alex Bowman and Denny Hamlin have won the first row like I said in the beginning of the video I won five points on my fantasy team for having Alex Bowman, Bowman winning the pole. Pole winner, of course, was Alex Bowman. I think the stage one winner is going to be Chase Elliott. Stage two winner, Kyle Busch, he won stage one last year in the Daytona 500. I think the manufacturing winner will be Toyota, if I am wrong, with the uh, race winner. I think the race winner will be Brad Keselowski. He's got a lot of wins at plate tracks. He's shown a lot of speed in the past. I mean, even the, in the clash, he, he made it to the front and led a lot of laps and ultimately won. So I think he will win the, the Daytona 500. So anyways, that's, I mean, that's about it. I don't really have anything else to talk about. The Propel Cup series is not, not done in any way, shape, or form. I've just been having a lot of trouble trying to get to it and trying to work on it. I've been really lazy for like the past five months. Sorry about not having a chase. I just really wanted to get this season done because I mean, I still have Jeff Gordon in my series and Justin Allgaier. Yeah, so I don't want to make you guys feel like I'm done with the Propel Cup Series because that's not even remotely the case. I'm just, I'm, I'm a really lazy person. Yeah, that's, uh, that's about where I'm at. If this is the first time you're seeing this video or any video on my channel, please, and you, and, and you liked it, uh, please subscribe. I feel like I should have talked about more things in this video, but uh, I, don't, I, I was just, it was a quick idea and it came to my mind and it was basically me winging it, so... Um, yeah if you guys liked it leave a like if you want to see more of my content please subscribe down below i have another channel if you guys are interested the channel link is down in the description below i have an instagram facebook twitter i always put those down in the, the description down below thank you guys for watching and uh, i will see you guys next week when i talk about the results of the daytona 500 and looking ahead to the next race at atlanta so